In today's video, I'll be explaining the Tetris Mobile slash Primetime scoring system. I made a spreadsheet that I'll be using for this video. It's in the link in the description down below. And credit to Garbo because I calculated the frenzy time, time multiplier by watching his uh, Twitch boards because I don't live in the 13 countries listed on the, the screen. Note. The score are estimated because how soft drop and hard drop give score, but it will be close or even perfect. Without further ado, let's begin. Okay, here's the spreadsheet here. So this is what I found. So the le the levels, I did not put it in a good way, but the level is just a multiplier. So for, for example, level 1 just 800 and level 2. To 1600 for Tetris is like so like times 2 times 3 times 4 to times 15 and that uh, will be the score and the base is on top here so 8000 8000 which is really something I found out that TSS does literally the same as a Tetris so depends on the situation you could just do a TSS so 800 800 and TSD does gets 1200 and TST gets 1600 for an, anyone who doesn't know TSD means T has been double TST means T has been triple TSS means T has been single and PC means perfect clear something interesting I found out that is that this all bumps up by 400 so from TSS to TSD it bumps up to from 800 to 1200 and then from TSD to TSS, TST it bumps up 400 and then so on and so forth for PC the thing is PC got hella nerf cause 2000 is nothing literally nothing you can do a DD cannon with the multiplier and which I'll explain later it, it can even do more and it can send off like something like an infinite TST or something like that and so the multiplier times frenzy time, even though in the wiki it says three times, what if a uh, two times? What I found is that frenzy time actually gives out three times, not really two times, which is a pretty big margin. And now back to back gives a uh, one point five multipliers to the score you have. So yeah, from like a TSD, like like uh, one you one down six. 600 times 1.5, which would be the back-to-back -back score, like that. So yes, obviously you want to go for TST or even just TSD, or like maybe like a, set up like a infinite TST, if you know how to do that, or even just ST stacking, which I will just demonstrate here on for the long, and then ST stacking, sorry for the keyboard noise, really just ST stacking, it's good or just do like something like a I don't think they have it on Oh yeah they do. Something like a infinite TSD here which is something like you do with a DT cannon you do like infinite TSD actually that's not like infinite TSD and all the other setups like TST. That's usually with the setup you want. PC, don't go for it. It's never worth it. It's sure you give 2000 points at the start, just like 400 more, but you can set up DT cannon, you want TKI, something like that to just counterbalance and kill PC like it's nothing. It's not worth it. So, yeah, that's all I found. This all will be in the link in the description down below, obviously. If you find if you guys find anything uh, interesting, you can leave it in the comments down below. And this took me a really long time, actually maybe like an hour or so. So be sure to leave a like down below, and I'll see you guys next time. See ya. So yeah, while researching a little bit more, something I found out is that. Actually, PC has different scoring. So for like, if you clear up one one line, then P clear line 
for PC, you can you only get two eight hundred, and then two line you only get one thousand six hundred, and the base score like that and like this. There's something interesting I found out. I don't know how I got two thousand previously, so uh, yeah, I found this out while literally researching. So yeah, something interesting. And this will be actually the end of the video, so if you like the video, like any any questions you can comment down below on the spreadsheet, it'll be in the descriptions and bye. Thank you.